Bill, Bill Gates is buying up thousands of millions. acres of farmland, yeah. probably millions. millions. There's, there's a couple other, I mean, BlackRock's in this business as well too. Between housing and our farmland being bought up, you have two very large, uh, largely wealthy oligarchs, Bill Gates, Larry Fink from BlackRock, that are trying to control our housing and trying to control our food supplies. So this is, this is where the, the tenets of the free market and a lot of traditional conservative thinking gets used against us because traditional conservatives will be like, but those guys, that's a private business. We can't touch a f private businesses. If you mess with private businesses, you're some sort of a socialist or a communist. Like, no, absolutely not. If you care about the sovereignty of your country, you stop that. You use antitrust laws to break them up and stop them from controlling that much critical infrastructure. And especially guys like... Bill Gates and guys like Larry Fink who have deep ties to the Chinese Communist Party, guys who use their wealth to manipulate elections, that absolutely 100% has to be stopped. Like the, those people that are going to use that farming land uh, for that ends that already control so much technology and so much wealth on Wall Street, they cannot be allowed to do that because we know that they're not, they're not trying to do that so they can build these farms and hire a bunch of Americans. Like they, they don't have the country's best interest at heart. And so we can't allow our own stated ideology to be used against us. That's where we have to fall back on. Do we have a country or do we have an economy? Like we have a sovereign nation that's gonna take care of our own people.